Allison, a Virginia woman, has found herself in a battle with the town of Vienna after a water main break caused tens of thousands of dollars in damage to her home. With no one else to turn to, she contacted Seven on Your Side. Chris Paps joins us now from Vienna with what he found on this case. Chris? Well, Leon, just in the past month, this suburban neighborhood in Vienna has had three water main breaks, the most recent one happening last week right here. You can see where the repair was. Now, when this water main broke, it sent water underground, obviously, and then downhill into the basement of this house right here, doing thousands of dollars in damage. And now the woman that lives here doesn't feel that she should have to pay for it. This cleanup crew has been busy for days, fixing an expensive mess that Donna Browse says she shouldn't have to pay for. It's not our fault. We didn't, it wasn't our pipes. It was nothing that we had done wrong. You know, we didn't, there was nothing faulty in the way we maintained the home. Last Thursday, following a water main break in her neighborhood, Browse's basement filled with more than a foot of muddy soup. For the next three days, she and her family lived with no running water and no heat. You got a new water heater, you got a new, new furnace, furnace, about $7,000. About $7,000, that, yeah, that we paid for, yes. The town of Vienna is paying for the initial cleanup, but the municipality won't cover the full cost of the restoration, which after carpet, furniture, drywall, laptops, and appliances are replaced, is estimated to cost $30,000. And Browse's homeowner's insurance won't cover it, saying it was the water company's fault. I want them to fix everything the way it was. I don't have the money to pay for this, this kind of money. Anytime that I hear um, that that happens, I, I feel bad about that. Mercury Payton is the Vienna town manager. He told Seven on Your Side that water main breaks are considered a, quote, act of God, meaning the township is not legally responsible for the damage. We have protocols that we go through that fall in line with the rest of the state of Virginia, and we try to follow those as best we can. Now, Peyton went on to say, if you do live in an older development or really anywhere and you want to get insurance to cover water main breaks, there is something called hazard insurance that you can buy. Live in Vienna, Chris Pabst, ABC 7 News. Okay, thank you, Chris. If you want to reach Chris and the 7 on your side team, you can just email tips at wjla.com or, or call the 7 on your side hotline. And uh, do that, get in touch with us, and uh, we'll try to see if we can take a look into your problem.